this week on Team Baborn. How much TNT do we have? We've got seven already. It's been built. Oh, good grief. Is this going to be a very bad idea? Welcome back to Tim... Oh, uh, wrong persona. Sorry, sorry. Welcome back to Team Baborn. Here we are in the city of Kettleborn. And yeah, we're in the middle of a bad tide at the moment. But we've pretty much got things under control, I would say. We've got 1.3 thousand litres of water. 1.3 thousand droplets of water. Who knows how they measure the water in this game. We've got loads of logs. We've got food for days. Potatoes and all sorts of things. We want to get working on some some new stuff and we want to be able to hold a load more water now in the last episode i spoke a lot about building up this area around here having this filled with water but yeah i that was not necessarily the best laid plan ever because of course if i start filling this up above here even if i build this level up to match this a lot of this land is lower and if i'm not going to fill this up i'm not going to be able to fill this up because the water doesn't keep just sort of pumping itself in until this fills up the side here so that plan was a little bit out there um we've got other plans that we can uh use with our water i mean we've got this filling up so we've got all this land now also what we could try and do which i've had a few comments about is building like a dam across the back here and just to block this off altogether when it comes round, and you'll have all of this filled with water Water as well that is one option all the other thought is just to get a load of tnt and blast your way through the land under here and to have even more water storage and i think that sounds like a fun thing to do i love it when it's night time and they've got nothing to do they just stand around staring into space <laughs> lovely beavers lovely beavers so we've got this planting is prioritized on these i've had a lot of comments about doing that there we go um this one actually does cover most of the area of these two so i'm actually going to leave that one as harvesting prioritized and it's got a little bit of an overlap and it helps which is good right so building lacks materials what are you lacking over here <laughs> you're lacking the flowers that i planted wrong okay we'll get there eventually um you don't have anybody working in there we'll get why not in there thank you very much for your support on patreon by the way lots of these beavers are named after my beautiful patrons that have been supporting me and you also get the option to watch a uh, series on there just for patrons satisfaction factory which has been going great gun so thank you very much for that uh lacking building materials oh what are we, what am i doing over here oh that's right yeah i was connecting to all of this what are we waiting for planks we have no planks at the minute this is the only place making our planks louise a trojan working away non-stop making our planks for us um i'd like to try and get some more plankage production over here we've got too many gears i think at the moment so you're gonna stop and yeah you're gonna go thank you for your work text cub sf angry canine you're gonna go well not you personally we've got no problems with you we just like deleting all of this around here there we go and then if we back these into here we can add another wheel into there which will be good and if we bring that out a little bit further add one of these on there <laughs> yeah that ain't gonna touch is it uh, <laughs> maybe we could add a cog on this one just to try and get this to work and then we can sort of bring the path again this is only this is only temporary isn't it until we get all the other stuff hooked up excellent please get those built for us we have got our very handy builders in the builders huts nobody's out of a job which is good so actually this shouldn't take too long oh we didn't take too long angry canine is already working away there making the planks for us thank you kindly hey there we go elwood working in the first wheel of fortune for us excellent thank you very much i call it that because they just love it they absolutely love it have you ever seen a hamster sorry gerbil sorry beaver who's not liked running in a wheel like this they just absolutely love it I don't know where you've heard bad things about these wheels from. Right, while we're waiting for this to get done, let's have a look at the dynamite options that we've got. So we've got dynamite, uh, 600 science, and take one dynamite. How am, I, how am I making these things? Oh, explosives factory. So that's going to need gears, planks, and metal. We are not getting any metal yet. Let's get on that. Oh, no. What to? Jalvad died of old age, but we've had Zombie Bat who's been born. So, <laughs> welcome to our colony. So, we do have a bad water pump. Now, I don't know how whether that just stores the bad water and then they're going to carry it over to the explosives factory or not. But we could certainly get that build once we've got metal. And then our nearest metal, I think, is this. There's none. Anyway, it's all the way up there. Yeah. So, why don't we start 
chipping away at this and we can get some paths and things going up here couldn't we there we go and then up here excellent and then we're going to get a flag a scavenger flag in for all of this metal all oh, right okay that is an unlockable item yeah we'll unlock that we've got 1.3k of science so that is fine and then that's for smelting them into metal blocks oh have we got to do that as well yeah bad water pump needs five metal blocks right okay we'll get that sorted somewhere too i think we'll get all of this stuff sorted first then we can start working on our industrial area bad tide has ended fan flipping tastic oh i think we're done all the way along here yeah this is all connected that's all done up there that all comes right i've just got to connect the darn thing up i hadn't even realized okay uh dot 83 you're out of a job, I'm afraid, my friend. Oh, how do I get over and up and down there? Oh, that's annoying, isn't it? Um, darn it. I tell you what we're going to do is we're going to do that and that. There we go. Excellent. And we'll get that all priority super duper high. Excellent. And we should have all the things that are needed for this. And then that hooks up our power and we can start taking away our Wheel of Fortunes. Although when the water's not running, of course, we were... Oh, my idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. There we go. There we go. Let's get all this filled up. Wow, that could have been bad. Are we connected? We're connected. Right, so network power supply, 400 or demand 100. So we don't actually need these to be worked. I'm going to leave them there. I'm not going to leave this one there. Elwood, you're free. That one's gone because I'm going to build sort of on the side over here and try and get some of these things going. So what else did we need? That was it, the smelter, which is made out of scrap because if it wasn't, that wouldn't make any sense, would it? 20 gears, we've got 35. Planks, 50 planks, we've got six. So this is going to take a while. Uh, yep, one of the little cogs that we've got down here from this to this. There we go. Excellent. That'll be good. And then we can sort of make use of this space over here as well. And also we could fit in another one of these next to this. There we go. Like that. Try and make use of the space. Excellent. That'll be good. How is all of this going? Oh, that's built. That's built. That. Oh, somebody's here already. Tabaka. Excellent. We've got nobody out of a job at the moment. Oh, we need to like harvest this. We're just not. Okay, you're out of a job. You're just not doing anything. Come over here. I want two of these. Thank you. That's going to be up. That's going to be up. Get that done. Yeah, I'm thinking this one efficient farmhouse is not quite efficient enough to, like, cover all of this area that we've got it doing. Um, maybe we could just squeeze another one in here <laughs> somewhere. Yeah, that will cover pretty much all of this as well. I'm going to put it there. Yeah, that's almost, almost, almost the whole thing. Yeah, we'll go with that. There we go. Oh, man, they're in there already. Look at that. Excellent. We bump you up a couple of levels. See how that goes. I'm trying to work out why we've got so much water. I've got these big log pumpers down here. We've got another thing we can fill up. Oh, we're in. Look at this building. So what are we getting here? We're getting that up to there. That's what we're doing. Angry canine. You just get everywhere, don't you? Scrap and logs. And we're going to get some of this lovely metal blocks, which we've set up to be stored over there fantastic so that is the next step towards what we need and then after that we're looking at a bad water pump so why don't we have a look over here now this is constantly bad water so we could just get ourselves up the top here and grab some of this we've already got access along the top could we work out some sort of path system or might we just sort of build something else up? Do you know what might be easier is to do something like this? Oh, that's it. That's all we need. I was thinking it would be more complicated than that. There we go. And we'll connect those up. And then this can always provide access to housing on the top of there. What have we got? Five free beds. I'm trying not to overpopulate. We're up to nine. I really want to get this up to 15 so we can unlock uh, some cool stuff. I'm just thinking whether is there some sort of well-being decoration thing I could pop down somewhere, which is really going to impress people. Beavers, I mean beavers, sorry, beavers. What about this? We've got like a little shrub. It's only 20 science, and it's got that, that overlapping. Oh, shame I can't get it right by the corner and cover both of these areas, but it's really cheap to build as well. So, yeah, I'm going to put that there. Hmm, what else have we got? We've got a beaver statue. That has got... Oh, look at that. I mean, if I put this... If I could find a spot for this, like around here somewhere where loads of people are beavers where loads of beavers are traveling it'll go in the water as well i mean i could stick it there everyone's going to be walking past it why don't we why don't we do that we're going to go for it 500 science oh this is going to look great 
Ooh, we need some more power. We're not quite... Oh, look at that thing. Clashing. Clashing the metal, which is good. But we need more power. Well, I can just connect these, can't I? Down the side like this. Excellent. That will be good. And that will double our power because I'm good at maths. Ah, oh, we've had a death. Oh, no. It's Melanie. That's a shame. She's really nice. Oh, in other news, our statue has been made. Our beaver, let's just say that this beaver statue is a statue of Melanie looking out over the water that she loves so much. What was Melanie's job? I, I can't remember what she did. But oh, she'll be missed so much. Every time they walk past, they'll be thinking of Melanie. Excellent. And also getting a nice little boost in well-being as well, which is what we want. Right, okay. So now we've got access to up and over here. Let's pop in a bad water pump. 250 science. Yeah, we'll unlock that. So if we just sort of pop I mean, one there. Does that mean then we do need some bad water storage? That would make sense. Uh, let's pop one of these in and see whether there is an option for bad water. Oh, is that it there? Bad water. There we go. We're going to do one of those and then we'll see if we need more. I'm assuming if they carry the bad water or if they work in here that it isn't going to be a problem. Please, I would assume. Oh man, we are just filling these things up with water. It's just like non-stop. Uh, 20 gears. Let's just chuck another one in. We'll put it at normal priority. You can fill up with water. I think it's just these two are just absolutely hammering it. We've got one here. We've got a couple over here. So do you know what? I'm going to actually pause these ones. Dot 83, when Jetty, you're out of a job. I'm going to pause you as well. And it might be that we start removing those because these are doing fantastic. Oh, the bad water pumps in. Who's going to be working in here? Let's up that. Jigel, thank you very much. You've got nowhere to put it yet, but you can store 15. Well, if you're ready, um, let's pop in the explosives factory. And I'm thinking that can just sort of go up here as well. 400 science. That is like all of our science nearly gone which is good we'll get that well not good that it's all gone but good that we've got it in excellent get that bad water going so you need 30 metal blocks and we're getting there we've got like four so we'll <laughs> we'll come back in a minute when that's all done i need this to be done as well for storing even more bad water and now i don't think we're too far away for making explosives Ooh, we've got a bad tide approaching in 2.9 days um are we in a good way with this well we've got absolutely tons of water we've got the same amount of beavers that we had before which is good i think this amount of beavers at the moment is enough for what we've got going on um i probably could do with a few more for like the farming and stuff but overall we've got so much food i'm not overly concerned uh planks and gears oh gears does any of this need gears this needs gears we need to turn on our gear production because i think we've slowed all that down or in fact we've completely turned it off there we go, and there we go. Angry canine back again. Oh, good grief. Jijel, Jijai, Jiji. You filled up this bad water amazingly already. There is so much there. I'm just thinking that we might as well just pop another couple in because, yeah, why not? Keep you busy and working. And these only take logs anyway. Oh, the beavers are off to work. The power wheels are in. So supply is 4, 12, whatever. Demand is 5. Now, why is demand so blooming high? Surely all of this is hooked up. And, okay, we're going to get more in there if we can make some space, which I think we can if we get rid of all of these. There we go. And then we're going to grab these and lay them out. And they may be a couple more like that would be okay. What have we got? 0.3 of a day left of a bad tide. I mean, I could... We could go for windmills. That is the other thing that a lot of people have been talking about. Um, power, the windmill, 150 logs and planks. Maybe we'll look at that another time. But any minute now, this is all going to go badly wrong. So I'm going to, yeah, we're going to open that one up. More grief that like arrives so quick. We're going to close this one up. There we go. And we should have enough water. Let's just make sure we're getting this right. There it goes. There it goes. All going that way, not coming through this way. Excellent dam situation there. And then if we come all the way down here, I'm going to pause you and I'm going to pause you. So you can go off and do something else. They are all nicely filled up. All of those are paused. Oh, six days. And then, of course, we've lost power. No! 
of this is why we need wind power. Maybe wind power is the next thing then we want to add on. We could just sort of plop a load along here and connect them straight up. Oh, what are these going to take? 120 science, logs and planks. And they do 150 each. What do these do each? Oh, we don't know until they're actually going. Why don't we add some of these in as well? So at least we've got something. There we go. Excellent. That should be good. Oh, we've got eight unemployed beavers. Let's get you working in the farms, me friends, me lads. What about these farms over here? You're full up. You're full up. You're full up. Excellent. You're working. You're the only one working, Louise making the planks for us because we've got a wheel of fortune going on there oh melanie poor melanie um what other jobs have we got i think we need to get our science going as well we are getting very low on science oh of course we can get some haulers in there we go and then over here we can add the rest to the builders oh our first windmills in as well very good not that it's connected to anything but it's doing 112 i don't know whether the height makes any difference with these with the wind and stuff if it does let me know but 112 actually out of each of these i think that's uh, i think that's good going oh i've had more da angry canine oh you've been around for so long dot 83 oh, i've been missing them all. all these ones that we know and love that have been working so hard for us and then the other beavers as well oh it's been such a shame oh melanie all brings back memories up to 11 though everybody who's left's rather happy and then once the power comes back in a big way all we need then is a few metal blocks <gasps> explosives factory ready to go so what's going to be the plan with explosives factory is it going to be that we're just going to dig all of this out even deeper so we can hold more and more water i mean that is a lot of tnt could we blow up a little tunnel through here just like a could i just like blow up a strip but then we can start filling this up and that's going to open up all of this do you know what i think that might be a fantastic idea and then suddenly we can then hold all of this field of water that is that is what we're going to do that is going to be our plan oh apparently the wind comes and goes it stopped so they've sort of just turned around a bit but they're not providing anything is there anything that we've got that will actually tell us a little bit more about the wind oh there is a wind gauge a small vein that turns in the direction of the wind and tells its strength uh no i'm not gonna do that and the wind has stopped okay yeah this is gonna be interesting trying to rely on that i know that there's a gravity battery what's that gonna be under yeah 400 science a lot of logs and planks and gears and all sorts of things for that we'll have to wait for that right so let me just have a think about what we're gonna do here i think what i'm gonna do is just dig this area out we're gonna need some sort of bridge which we'll be able to do with a path so let's mark some of these for destruction the bad tide has ended oh, okay let's do that in a second and it's all nearly almost 100 percent quite finished going i think that's near enough yeah very good let's open this whoosh ah flood everybody let's just pop that up to half height there we go that will go nicely then the power gets back oh everything's working what is the power everything's working everything's working i want to get the overall power when everything's going which it is 1000 and oh it's rising it's rising 1150 i thought was the highest there excellent so we're well in the limits of the amount of power that we need to run all of these things why are you thirsty we've got water here oh the water down here has run out of water okay let's get you going get you going very good very good and yeah take some people off builders and all that sort of stuff i'll do that oh our next inventor science thing is in who's that gonna be Zamurabad, thank you very much for getting the science working for us. Stop being so thirsty. You can walk all the way down here to get your water. It's a long way. Um, all of these are empty as well. Wow, okay, that was a lot of empty water containers there. So maybe get all these filled up as soon as possible. You're still all working in there, aren't you? No, you're not. Why not? Why, why are they not working in there? Come on, what are they all doing? We need to kick some more people out of these builders and the haulers and things oh i'm an idiot they were turned off let's turn them back on again there we go everybody's balanced out we're making of the water again fill all the things yeah good 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 so basically we're just waiting on this thing to finish i'm just wondering whether we could pop in another one of these to really boost the power it's going to mean maybe just jiggering this around a little bit so we can get things next to each other oh there we go both working away judge gridis and word dog. Uh, he needs like a pair of dark glasses on or something like that doesn't he 
<laughs> Excellent. Oh, it's in. Oh, no, don't tell me this needs power. Oh, I'm a complete numbskull. Um, I'm thinking we'll just delete that and move it over there because I'm not going to get power. How much power does it need? I mean, it needs 150. So a couple of water wheels in here where the water's always running would actually work fine. So I'm reckoning if we do this like that and then this one here can come up this way bonk 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 and bonk and that can connect up like that and they probably just can't even get around there because of the way i've set everything up <gasps> i feel like we need another path up here somewhere there we go that will do get all that on high priority and then we'll get all of this on high priority bonk 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 and i'm really hoping oh no hang on hang on hang on we'll put all of this on lower low 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 property because i want them to get and do this first there we go and then do that and then hopefully with the two of those that will be uh, more power than we need to get this thing going to make our tnt so just looking at the math here this holds 30 bad water this needs five bad water and three hours for one stick of tnt so we have got a heck of a lot of TNT that can go on there. So this actually isn't as expensive as I thought it was going to be. Hopefully you're building this thing up first and not being Muppets. And then I'm going to get all of this on high priority. Zink, zank, zonk. There we go. Oh, it's going already. We got uh, Azib is working in there, which is very good. Are we getting enough power? A hundred percent. Excellent. Oh man, we've got our first bit of TNT. Oh, good grief. Oh, good grief. Is this like a completely ridiculous plan? We're going to do that. Oh, good grief. Is this going to be a very bad idea? Let's just get all of those removed. And then if we go back into the landscaping and pick our... Got to unlock it as well. We're literally making it and we've got to unlock it. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to need another one there. Let's wait until we've got enough explosives to put in there. We'll do that. And then we'll put a little platform with a bridge over the top. And I think that'll be fine. I mean, it's like, yeah, because that's the only layer that's there. And then it's going to drop down. And then this is all going to fit. Man, this is just like, I'm creating. Oh, it's in. <gasps> oh, good grief. They already got the dynamite in and we've got a spare one. Okay, well, we're going to do that. Uh, let's place another one there and get that on a high priority. It's been built. Thank you very much, Kizzy. Oh, good grief. Oh, good grief. Oh, good grief. They're in. I'm going to pause it. Detonate, 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 detonate. <laughs> We're going to unpause. Let's just see what happens. Oh, yes. And now the water's flowing in, which is going to like drop the levels down quite a bit. Oh, look at this. This is a fantastic idea. This area here, look at that, is now all green. We can add more farms. Oh, this is just brilliant. What a fantastic idea. There we go. Everybody's connected up again. There we go. That's it. It's reached the top. That is absolutely brilliant. So now I'm looking at this area here, thinking, can we get some water to come through here? Because that is a lower piece of land if we could just blow up a couple of three of those would that be low enough i think it would and then it's going to go all the way around this way and connect up to there which then just rings the whole thing in water surely that would then unlock all of this land for building even more stuff on Flipping out the possibilities look how much tnt do we have we've got seven already oh good grief I tell you what that's going to be for next time we've harnessed bad water we've got an explosive oasis which is absolutely fantastic thank you for your continued support especially those that have supported me on patreon as well if you're interested there's a link below you can get to watch my satisfactory series on there as well and i will see you all very soon for the next one it'll be next week next saturday be back for that have a great day take care Bye bye